Hi, everybody. Well, the Blue Bombers are back at it this weekend for a rare Sunday night game. They visit the Hamilton Tiger Cats. It kicks off at 4 our time. We'll have a two-hour pregame show. I invite you to join me and Doug Brown and Kelly Moore and Neil Lumsden for the broadcast. If revenge is a motivating factor in any sporting event, the Bombers will have that going for them on Sunday in Hamilton because the Tiger Cats were here a few weeks ago and beat the Bombers 52-26, to you might recall. Drew Willie was hurt early in that game, and when he went out, the Bombers went down, and this game on Sunday will feature another matchup between two of the outstanding young quarterbacks in the CFL in Drew Willie of the Bombers and Zach Kolaris, the young quarterback of the Hamilton Ticats. Ticats with a 3-2 and two record. They lead the East. The Bombers are 3-3 three and three going into this game, the second and final meeting of the season between the two clubs. And for me, the three keys in this game for a Bomber victory are number one, taking the crowd out of the game. They'll have a sold-out crowd again at Tim Hortons Field in Hamilton. The Tiger Cats haven't lost there in the eight games they've played since the stadium opened last year. And I think the Bombers really have to get off to a quick start to kind of silence that crowd a little bit. Secondly, Zach Kolaris, the Hamilton quarterback, is very good when he moves out of the pocket and throws on the run. He's had some of his best success this year doing that. So containing him, keeping him inside, really a key for the Blue Bombers. And then the other thing is protection for Bomber quarterback Drew Willie. If he gets time, I think he can do some work against that Hamilton defense, which surrendered over 400 yards last week, even though they beat the Argos. So protection up front, really critical for the Bombers. Bombers and Hamilton Sunday night. It starts at 4 our time. We're on the air with a pregame show at 2. Please join us for the broadcast on 680 CJOB.